Hey y'all, it's Georgie from GSD Solutions. And in this video, I'm gonna talk to you all about the easiest way to live stream to multiple platforms. So do you wanna LinkedIn live stream, Facebook, YouTube, or even to your own private uh, RTMP location? Well, StreamYard is the tool to use. It is super easy to set up. There are so many templates and it's so flexible and easy to use, right? I'm not gonna stop saying easy to use because it really and truly is. My company and I, we've been using this platform for years now. And if you come on, you can see a small tutorial as well as we have some tutorials around how to use the platform. And in this video, what I wanna show you how to do is one first, when you get to the platform, you wanna select your pricing package. So the best thing about this platform is that you can try before you buy. Essentially, they have a free account that you could create or depending on how many needs you have, how many platforms you wanna to go to and how much customizations you need, you could then upgrade to a paid package. So now let's get into it. You're on StreamYard, you've logged in, you've created your account and you wanna create a live stream. What we're gonna do here is simply hit create. Then we could select from an option of live stream, recording or on air. I'm gonna do a separate video that talks about the recording and on air features, but here we're gonna do live stream. So we're gonna go ahead and click live stream which we will then have the option to live stream from the studio. That means you're doing the live stream right now or you can select a pre-recorded video that you want to air as a live stream. So that's a really cool feature in which you will then upload the video. But we're gonna just go live in the studio. So we're gonna select the platform we wanna go live to. And if you want to add a new platform, you'll select add a new destination. Then it'll give you the option of Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube, X, Instagram, Twitch, Hopin, and more. So I've already connected my Facebook, so I'm gonna go ahead and hit that. I'm gonna name this test session. And you could put a nice little description. And the cool thing too, that if you wanna schedule the live stream for later and then kind of market it beforehand, you can hit schedule for later, select the time you'd like to schedule it for, and then upload a, a thumbnail. For the sizing for the thumbnail, there's gonna be a link down below for you to get um, a thumbnail template that we've created for StreamYard. So I'm gonna have this live stream right now. So we're gonna go ahead and hit create live. And that's, half the work already done. So while it's building my virtual studio and it's getting me uploaded, what I can do is select my name and then hit enter studio. Once I'm inside of the studio at the far right side of my screen, I'll be able to select the different designs I want. So you, depending on your account, you could create different brands. So here we have brands. If we select from the far right menu, the brand button, and I have multiple brands for myself and my clients. So here's the GSD branding. And from there, I could then add myself to the stage as well as select the view from the stage. So this is another feature that we're gonna dive into in another video. And you could create different backgrounds. You could additionally select your color, your theme, add logos, overlays, videos, uh, video backgrounds, as well as background music. And once you've had your studio set up, all you have to hit is go live and then your session will automatically broadcast to your selected platform. So let's go ahead and hit go live. It's going to select the quality. And that's, we're off to the races. So I'm going to go ahead and just share my camera. So right now, folks on uh, Facebook are seeing this live stream. And if you want to get the direct link, you could go ahead and click here and then view on Facebook. It'll then open up a new tab to the platform that you're going live to. And you can see it from there. So here I am, and it shows me how many people are joining my live session, how long I've been live for. And when I'm on Facebook, it'll show me all the details. I could then share that link with whomever is in my network. So that is quick and easy how you go live on StreamYard. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the stream take myself off of the stage. And in another coming video, we're gonna talk about how do you invite people to your live stream and how to use some more of the functionalities inside of StreamYard Studio. But within less than five minutes, you can live stream to multiple platforms. Super cool, super easy to use. If you're interested in live streaming and you want someone to handle all the technology, reach out to us at gsdsolutionsinc.com. This is what we do. We support event producers, planners, anyone that's involved with the event process, we help you find and use the best technologies as well as provide tech support from when you're live streaming, doing virtual meetings or events. So talk to us today. If this video was helpful, go ahead and hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to see any specific tutorials, let us know in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one.